So today I'm talking about a P2238 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a P2238 code? Well, it's an O2 sensor, positive current control, circuit low, bank one, sensor one. And what does this mean? Well, basically there's what's called oxygen sensors and they're located on the exhaust and they do two things. The first thing they do is they monitor the catalytic converter. And then the second thing they do is they monitor how much oxygen was burnt off during combustion. And they send this information to the computer, which uses the information to adjust the air fuel ratio mixture that's going into the cylinders. But when you get a P2238 code, the computer's seeing some kind of problem with this, mainly inside the wiring on bank one, sensor one, oxygen sensor. And so it's going to have to be troubleshooted to know why. And if you have a V6 or a V8 engine, you're going to have two banks. Bank one is always the side of the engine with the number one cylinder. So if you find the number one cylinder on your engine, that's going to be bank one. And then the opposite of that would be bank two. Cylinder one can be located differently depending on the engine, the year, the make, different things like this. So be sure to look that up. If you have a four cylinder engine, it wouldn't matter because you'd only have one bank. It can be a good idea to get a diagram where all those sensors are located and what's going on. Since there can be differences depending on the vehicle, the year, the make, different things like this. But usually there's going to be two oxygen sensors on each bank of the engine. Bank one, sensor one is going to be located before the catalytic converter, sometimes called the upstream O2 sensor. And sensor two is going to be located after the catalytic converter, sometimes right on it. And it's also called the downstream O2 sensor. But the main one the computer's seeing a problem with is going to be this bank one, sensor one, oxygen sensor. And so what would be some possible causes of a P2238 code? Well, the first thing that could cause is that that bank one, sensor one, O2 sensor just failed. It's just gone bad. It just needs to be replaced. So the first thing to do is go test that O2 sensor. There's some different ways to go about testing that sensor. If you have a good OBD2 scan tool, you can go test it that way. You can also use a multimeter to test them. So there's some different ways to go about testing it. There's some good YouTube videos on that. But the first thing that could cause this is a bad oxygen sensor. The next thing that could cause this is the wiring going to the O2 sensor. Basically, if there's any problems in the wiring, like an open, a short, there's a bad connection somewhere, something along these lines, then that's going to cause problems. It's a good idea to get a wiring diagram or schematic for what's going on with your vehicle to know for sure what's going on. And since there can be some differences, you're usually going to have a heater element built into that O2 sensor, which help it heat up quickly and help it go into what's called a closed loop faster. And then you're also going to have the oxygen sensor side and that's monitoring how much oxygen was burnt off during combustion. But if that O2 sensor tests good, then the next thing to go and check is going to be the wiring going to the sensor. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a vehicle with the P2238 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me. I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you. Please click like. Please click subscribe. And have a good day.